This is day five of the United Auto Workers strike against Detroit's big three automakers. Jeff Cooperstein, a researcher and economist at the University of Arkansas, says the strike could start impacting local businesses depending on how long it goes. He says the longer the strike continues, auto parts manufacturers like Deco Products and Springdale, for example, have a higher chance of struggling. How much the manufacturers struggle depends on if they produce a lot for Ford, General Motors, and Stellantis. Cooperstein says a successful strike could send a message to other workers around the country. If the strike is successful, then I think that tells workers in the auto industry and in other industries as well that this is a good time for you know, workers to, to unionize and to exercise their collective bargaining power. We've seen success, successful, you know, union action at Starbucks, at Amazon. Cooper Stein also says that the workers start getting paid more, the money will be put back into the economy differently than if it went to corporate profits and stock dividends.